Here's something healthy your family will actually enjoy. Great tasting water from Culligan. And no matter where you live or work, Culligan will deliver cold, refreshing water right to your door. So make the talk around the water cooler, about the water cooler. Experience the difference Culligan can make. Culligan, better water, pure and simple. Call your local Culligan dealer, James Fisher and Son, at 545-1330. Dealer participation may vary. Visit Culligan.com for details. The Cardinal Newman football team has reloaded for 09 with enough firepower to once again contend for the league and section titles. Coach Paul Cronin has this group ready to make their mark. Um, every year is a little bit different. I think this team, we have... Uh, some great guys that work real hard in the off season, have great expectations. We're a little inexperienced in certain spots, which we're trying to overcome, but I think it's going to be a fun group to coach. Having lost many great players to graduation, it is now up to last year's backups and younger players to step in and excel. I think we have a bunch. I think our offensive line is really gelling. Um, we have Tucker Maggio, Eddie Rutherford, Christian Alvarez, Russ Van Anda, and Chris Morales doing a great job gelling. We've got a couple quality backups. And then at running back and quarterback, we've got some real physical guys, so we're excited about how we can run the ball. Then we have some returning receivers, Chris Reuter and Bryson Dumont and Nico Felice with a new addition of Evan Merritt, who's a great lacrosse player and runs real well. It kind of reminds me of Brandon Simpson, uh, how he played back at Piner High. And then with a a couple young guys, Marino and Quok, that have done a good job. So we're excited about our offensive talent. Now it's just about just putting everything together and becoming more experienced. We can play well in games. Taking over at linebacker is Blake Ratto, who is filling in the shoes of Jeff Badger, now playing at Sac State. Uh, Jeff was a great player. I learned a lot from him. You know, I was his backup, and I just watching him play, and I learned a lot. And what I learned mostly was uh, how tough and physical you have to be to play linebacker. And you just got to know your stuff and know your goals. Blake, you know, he's, he's one of those guys that he played a lot of snaps last year. Joe and Jeff uh, were our starting linebackers, but Joe had a few injuries and Jeff had to get rest. So Blake's really a returning starter, and he was a playmaker. I think the game in my mind stands out is Rancho Katati, and he came in. And he played great for us against Rancho, who had a great team last year. And then he started in the section championship game, played every snap against Clayton Valley. And he really is a, a you know, exceptional football player because he's such an athlete. Anchoring the line is Tucker Maggio, who brings size, strength, and speed to the trenches for CN. Uh, my personal goal is for to make my, the team as good as I can possibly make it, whether that be playing offensive line, defensive line, making a good block, making a tackle. Uh, just overall having the team successful because of the work I put in. Hey, you know, Tucker, I think, is just a big-time player. He runs real well. We've had a, a, a lot of luck in our offensive line the last uh, six years I've been here, and he's one of the better better guys we've coached. He's 6'4", he's 250, he's a really intelligent kid, and he runs probably better than any offensive line we've had. Newman has a great tradition at quarterback, and this year's starter Jack James should step right in and lead the offense. You know, we, we've had the luck of having great quarterbacks here, and they've overcome coaching. So we're excited about Jack also. He's a big guy. He's a little bit different than, than Randy and Max were. He's more of a physical type of guy, but he really throws the ball well, and he's put a lot of effort into the offseason preparation. So I think Jack's going to play great this year for us. I'm really excited to see Jack James play quarterback because he's just he runs the ball real hard real aggressive likes to hit newman has been to state two of the last three years but the players and coaches try not to think about that as they prepare for a brutal non-league schedule I mean, we don't put that as a goal really not a goal we're trying to be the best team we can be and if that works out that works out but you really can't control it because it's off power rankings you're not playing games you're you're working on a computer so we don't really focus on that our goal is to be the best team we could be at the end of the year and whatever happens it works out uh, well I don't really think ahead you know going to stay I take it game by game but Central Catholic is gonna be a big game for us and I mean I'm excited I've played them since I was JV and they've always been a good team and it's always been a good game um, right now we don't feel that pressure because we're a different team uh, we're just going to do as well as we possibly can and work as hard as we can to achieve that. You know, you always feel like you're, you're not ready. So I know that right now I don't sleep a ton because you you got a great team. You're going to play game one and you're just you're nervous that your team's not ready and you're not going to play as well as you know you can. So we're, game ones are scary for, you know, us. I think they're really difficult and we're, we're scrambling to get ourselves in the best position we can before we play the game. There's always great competition in Montgomery and Rancho Katati and Yukai and Creo and League. So we're just looking forward to getting started and, and, and seeing how we do in the games.